The term Libya Dong, or Libya Dong Coalition, is used to refer to the armed groups and slash or the wider political movement supporting the new GNC. The new GNC is one of the major sides in the ongoing Second Libyan Civil War. The new General National Congress claims to be a legitimate continuation of the obsolete General National Congress elected in 2012, but does not represent a majority of the membership of that Congress. The majority of the GNC members belong to groups now participating in the internationally recognized Libyan Parliament, the Council of Deputies. The new GNC is dominated by the Muslim Brotherhood's Libyan Party, the Justice and Construction Party, and the Loyalty to Martyrs Bloc which consists of other smaller groups allied to the Muslim Brotherhood. Re-elected members from the losing Islamist Bloc have chosen to sit in the self-proclaimed new GNC, instead of the Council of Deputies where they would be in a reduced minority. After their landslide defeat in the 2014 elections dominated by low turnout, Islamist parties acting under the leadership of Nouri Abuzamain used two armed groups, the Libya Revolutionaries Operations Room and Libya Shield Force, to take control of the capital Tripoli. In late August, Islamist militias allegedly abducted rivals, whose whereabouts are unknown, and attacked 280 homes. The GNC has rejected affiliation with any of these activities and it is unknown who the exact perpetrators were with both sides blaming each other. The Islamist groups declared that they were the General National Congress and that it was once again the National Parliament. The self-proclaimed GNC is led by its president, Nouri Abuzamain, and an interim prime minister, Khalifa al gawai Nouri Abuzamain was formerly president of the GNC which existed from August 8, 2012 to August 4, 2014. Members of the Council of Deputies and the new General National Congress signed a United Nations-supported political agreement on December 17, 2015. Under the terms of the agreement, a nine-member Presidency Council and a 17-member Interim Government of National Accord would be formed, with a view to holding new elections within two years. The House of Representatives would continue to exist as a legislature and an advisory body, to be known as the State Council, will be formed with members nominated by the new General National Congress.